the LPS Marcus channel and its videos are rated PG-13. Videos as of 2020 contain mature themes, mature humor, and things not suitable for a young audience. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello everyone, it is me, LPS Marcus, here back on another Saturday morning with another great YouTube video. I first off would like to let you guys know Vlogmas 2023 is going to be coming next weekend. So looking forward to launching this year's Vlogmas, stay tuned for that. But today, besides Vlogmas coming up, I've got a great video for you guys. You may or may not know that the official Littlest Pet Shop Roblox game is now out. So today, we're going to be playing it, and I'll be giving you guys my first thoughts as we play the game as it's just released. So let's jump into it right now, and let's get on to Roblox. Well, hey everyone. Now you can see we are officially here. About to launch the LPS Roblox game. The game just came out 55 minutes ago as of the time of recording of this video. But it's been pretty fun so far. I haven't done too much. I just got a few pets. But we're going to jump back into it. Because I was recording earlier but then the game crashed. And uh, my, my recording software crashed too. Hopefully we won't have that issue this time around. Once we're all loaded up here. It just may take a second for all like the assets to load in. Here we go. It says, don't forget to play with your pets. Make sure you remember that, folks. Look at that. Littlest Pet Shop. I've been making TikToks about it for the past little bit. And it is finally here on Roblox. Turn down the volume a little bit, just so. There we go. And everyone's joining. Everyone's loading in. See up here, we got my two pets with me right now. I have a level two corgi and a level two a level two poodle. And the train is right here. Can we get on the train? No, we can't. It definitely reminds me of the LPS Wii game though. Because if you remember the LPS Wii game, that actually had the uh, the train in it. So it really reminds me of that. So it's pretty cool. For the sake of the video, let's try and get another pet. The panda is the one we're after. It's pretty rare. 5% chance. Imagine we get the panda. Are you kidding? I have three poodles now. Because I have a second one in my inventory. Let's try and get the panda. Come on. Panda, pan... Are you kidding? We got another poodle. Look at my inventory, you guys. We got four poodles. You can't make this up. It's funny. Hoping you can combine them then, maybe. And we'll be able to make, like... Some sort of special version of the poodle. Okay, I don't want to blow all my coins right away. I want to save space in my inventory. But there's a pet that we haven't had yet. A spaniel. So let's bring out the spaniel. Imagine if we got another poodle. That would have been funny. I probably would have been mad. But hey. What can you do? So it's pretty nice here. If you go up to any of these activities, like things, you can click on one of your pets, and I don't know why it's showing all six at the bottom, because I only have three of them out. And I'm pretty sure I only have... Oh yeah, for some reason my icons are showing twice. That must be a glitch. Yeah, it looks like it's a glitch. So yeah, for some reason all the icons down there are showing twice, even though I only have the three pets out. So just, uh... Just ignore those, because it's a glitch. The game is out early, remember? It's, it just launched, so naturally there will there'll be some glitches. Okay, the skateboarding seems to be quite popular. Not sure if we can do anything with the fountain or not. Let me just adjust my volume here, my recording software. Just to make sure you guys can hear me all good, and you should be able to turn this up a little, just so the game audio is a little... Louder than it was. There we go. And we can go swing here. You can see there's someone else here with their pets. And this uh, swing around thing, merry-go-round here is actually uh, not merry-go-round, but it's I forget what it's called. But it's pretty cool because there's room for 12 pets, so I can get all my pets on there. Hold on, come on, does my spaniel want to go on there? There we go. And you can click on the little thing here, and look, you can get your pet to do a trick. 
Look at this. Is my spaniel going to do a trick? Watch my spaniel. Look at that. He's rolling over. The only issue I'm having is getting this menu to close. So I might have to put my spaniel back just to get that to close for now. It's over here. Not too sure what that is, but I like this area over here because I love the beach. And I'm already missing summer being over here because it's like a nice beach. And we have some nice beaches here where I live in Nova Scotia, so it reminds me of that. So this game already has me missing the summer. And look at that, my pet is building a sandcastle. And if you wanted to as well, your pet can go jet skiing. Look at that, my corgi is a zoom in. Yo, let's get one on this jet ski and we'll get one on the other. See if they both jet ski at once. Yeah, look at that. That's awesome. Probably going to constantly hear the sound of coins all video. Because every time you do an activity, you get coins. So, And my pets keep giving me coins because I'm out with them as well. Yo, this person has a bull. They also have a poodle. Is this like another uh, thing here? Like they have 12 pets, so we'll get both of mine on it. And the cool thing is, beyond the uh, pets in the game as well, you are actually going to be able to buy Littlest Pet Shop toys in real life. The pre-sale is now out on Amazon. They're now available here in Canada where I live at Toys R Us. And with some of the pets um, you buy in real life, you'll get exclusive codes that you can redeem for in-game pets. So it's a lot like the... Um, what game am I thinking of? Oh, the old Littlest Pet Shop mobile game, because there was a mobile game where you could scan in your pets. So it kind of reminds me of that. Only, of course, this one is a bit different. It's here on Roblox, on the desktop, and on mobile. And we got the old pets back, but you can get the old pets in the game, so... It's obviously a lot different. I haven't checked out this area yet. So this is a cool little farm area over here. There's a tractor. Reminds me of going to the country, visiting my grandparents. They live out in the valley. I also remember I was in grade 9 in school on a field trip, and we actually went to an apple farm, and it was very cool. Look at this. There's some carrots in here. Now what can we do with the carrots? Plant carrots, I guess. Let's get my poodle to plant them as well. The corgi was the first pet I got at the start of the game. Then I got the other few. I got a lot of poodles, like I said. I don't know what I'm going to do with my coins. Check here. So you can buy gems. I'm not sure what the gems are for. And we haven't unlocked Frosty Haven or Summit Peaks yet. Now what's this trophy thing? I'm just clicking to look at this. Uh, oh, we, we got some achievements, I guess. Use swings ten times. Road tractor ten times. Here we go. We're getting lots of gems just from doing stuff. I didn't even realize that. Whoa. The pet merry-go-round. Maybe that is what the thing was called. The apple tree, we did that. And I'm not too sure what gems will buy you. Because I haven't seen anything yet that has costed gems. Maybe we'll find something in this video. And make sure you guys do what the back of my Roblox character's shirt says. Which it says, if you can't read it, it says, Subscribe to LPS Marcus on YouTube today. Be sure to do that. I hear the train. We're not going to worry about the carrots again for now. Let's check over here. Let's go on the train. Purchase a train ticket. 
Oh, it costs 5,000 coins to go to Summit Peaks. So that's how we unlock it. Okay. That's good to know. So, I don't know what else to do here. We'll, we'll get our pets to do some things, I guess. We'll maybe try and get some coins, go to Summit Peaks. And for those who are wondering about my Vlogmas this year, I'm planning to hopefully start doing a Vlogmas next weekend. So this weekend, of course, you have my Roblox video. The game is launched. And next weekend, I'm hoping to start Vlogmas up. Because this week as well, coming up, I have some final stuff for school. But then my winter break is started. So once my winter break is started, I'll have Vlogmas for you guys. No problem. And I'm looking very forward, of course, to starting Vlogmas back up. Oh, there's an apple tree here. My corgi is actually almost level 3. Let's get my pool to go. Oh, my corgi is level 3. You see that? The only issue is it does not seem to update on here until I'll have to put my Corgi back into my inventory. Take him back out. And there we go now. It shows level 3. For some reason, though, like I said, it wasn't doing this glitch to me earlier, but it's doing this glitch now where it won't update on here. It's showing two icons when I only have the one pet out. Yo! My Corgi is a better driver than me in real life. Just kidding. I'm not a bad driver by any means, but... Just all jokes, but... It's funny to see these pets drive. I think there's some... Coins. Yeah, there's some coins on the ground here, too. I didn't even see those. And I want to see what's in here. If we can go into this building. Can we go into it? Clicking on the door. No, I don't think we can. Yeah, I don't think there's anything in there. And over here, there's a little pet shop. Hold on a second. So is there anything? Because I know you can buy that there. I want to see, is there anything else? Like, No, there's nothing over here. Just the register. But that's a cool building. And then that is where you buy the pets right there. This person has three pets as well. And we got to reconnect. It looks like the game crashed on me. But that's okay. We should be able to reconnect here. No problem. Here we go. Yeah, here we are. We're back now. I can just edit that out, but I'll leave it because you guys are seeing for yourselves as well. Some of the issues some of us are facing as we're trying to play the game. I'm sure many other LPS tubers are going to be posting today too, playing the game. So maybe you'll see the same thing from them. But if not, you're seeing it firsthand for me. There are some issues. But hey, the icons are not glitched anymore. That's nice. And we're back at the pet shop where we started. And I'm not sure about the train here. But I think we already bought the train ticket here. Let's get my pet skateboard. Let's get my poodle to skateboard. My poodle's about to be level 3. Let's do it. Yo! He went upside down and everything. Did you see that? That was awesome. We can go to the swings here, too. This actually does remind me a lot of the Littlest Pet Shop Wii game. And, of course, we need 5,000 coins. We don't have that yet, but when we get it, I want to try and unlock that other place. And there's also the snowy place, which I'm not sure how you get a ticket there. Maybe you have to unlock the other one first. That's what I would assume, but... Teeter-totter here. 
And if you remember correctly, there actually was a teeter-totter minigame in the original Littlest Pet Shop Wii game. So it looks like a lot of the inspiration for this game has been drawn from the Wii game, I think. Now what's here? I was just walking to see if we can get like a good thumbnail, but I don't know if I'll use the thumbnail straight from Roblox, not too sure. Either way, we'll worry about making the thumbnail later. I'm interested. I want to see if anyone's going to buy a pet and if they're going to get the panda in front of me. You know what? I only have six pets. We could get f four more. We can try and get the panda. And even... Okay, the corgi was only 10%. I didn't realize that. I doubt we'll get a panda. Well, let's just do another on video just for the heck of it. Oh, it's a spaniel, okay. And the spaniel is a more common one. We already have one spaniel. I'm sure there will also be a way to get rid of pets in your inventory. Because we already have 7 out of 30. And if we're buying pets in real life and redeeming the codes, it'll obviously fill up quick. So I'm sure they'll implement something if, if there isn't one already that I know of. Because there's still a lot of stuff I don't know about the game. This is like my first time playing it. It literally just released just over an hour ago. But it's pretty good so far. I'm liking it. And we're pretty much just running around doing stuff with our pets. But that's kind of all you did in the LPS Wii game. Either way, I'm having fun. And I love seeing these pets on Roblox. And just having old LPS come back. It's amazing. It's incredible. And it's a dream come true. When I started collecting LPS in 2016, the LPS in stores were the not good ones, and ones people weren't fond of, so... Even myself missed out on the old LPS being in stores when I was little, so to have them come back now and have them in stores, it's amazing. Sorry, I'm checking my phone as well. I've actually been talking to a lot of LPS tubers about the game. Um, so yeah, even they're texting a lot right now, and I just see a text as well here, it's from LPS Susie, shout out to LPS Susie, um, who's scared to buy more pets, because she doesn't want her space to fill up, I'm feeling the same way as LPS Susie, also shout out to, uh, Blue Cat LPS, Malpaca LPS, Pet Shop Pigeons, and everyone I've been talking with about the LPS Roblox game, because... It's great to talk to members of the LPS Tube community as well. I think we're all feeling very excited. So shout out to all of them. And oh, well, speaking of people from the LPS Tube community, LPS Cream Collie is here. I'll say what's up? What's up? I'm recording. What's up? I'm recording a video. It's funny as I'm talking about as I was talking about some LPS tubers I'm talking to who are also playing the game. Here's another member of the LPS community who is also playing the game. So that's cool, we finally uh, have found someone who found LPS Cream Collie. But like I said, I've been talking to a lot of members of the LPS community, and it's amazing to see the excitement we all have for this game, and just for the old LPS coming back. It's awesome, it's bringing the community together, and I love it. And LPS Cream Collie is already one step ahead of me. She's got a level 3 kitten. I don't even have the kitten yet, so I'm jealous. I'm hoping it won't take too long to get to 5,000 coins, but that is a lot of coins to unlock that one place. Yo, he's going around the hay bales and everything. Hold on, I wonder what would happen if I stand in the way. Would my pet, like, run me over? I want to see. Oh, no. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, it went through me, I think. I don't think your pet can actually run you over. <laughs> That'd be... Well, the game would probably be 17 plus if you would have your pet running you over. And I don't know. I don't want to speculate too much. But I'm sure they wouldn't put that in the game. I was just testing it to see. But obviously, I, I didn't think anything would actually happen there. 
I love seeing the pets other people have too. I'm sure as the toys are out more in stores, we'll see a bunch of unique pets. We'll see people with lots of rare pets and pets you can't just buy flat out in the game. Oh, I think LPS Scream Collie crashed. That's too bad. All right, my game crashed earlier and you guys saw it crash on video. So what I've been doing, I'll show you guys. I go into settings and I put my... Never mind. I did have my graphics quality lowered, but it went back up. For some reason, I'm just getting lucky then, and, and the game is not crashing for me. I'm not sure why, because I was having that issue earlier. But now we're not for some reason. But this is all beautiful. And it definitely does remind me of Roblox Adopt Me, for sure. Just get one of my pets to go on the trampoline. Can we? Did one of them want to go on the trampoline? Oh, there we go. Look at my corgi. Let's get my poodle to, to go jump as well. Whoops. So I crashed twice. I don't want to buy any more pets. I'm scared. Like I said, Susie LPS said the same thing. Scared to buy pets because the game... Um, or the space will fill up. And I'm feeling the same way. I would love to try and get the panda on video. But I already have seven pets. I don't want to get too many now. You see, it's LPS Cream Collie 78. It's funny, we're actually running into people today. I haven't ran into any other LPS tubers or members of the community on the game. Hopefully we'll run into some more. Because I was actually trying to join Malpaca LPS and LPS Blue Cat. And I don't think I got into either of their games. Because if they're here, I haven't seen them. So the only person I've actually seen has been LPS Cream Collie. But I know they're all playing it, so hopefully I'll run into them at some point. Or we'll even run into some other LPS tubers too. Regardless, I'm having a lot of fun. I wonder if we can get into the lighthouse over there. I doubt it. There's probably like a barrier. Probably can't go. Yeah, we can't go past there. That's too bad because I was going to try and go over to the lighthouse. But I guess it's just for scenery. But if you look at this island here, this is just amazing. And it's amazing to have Littlest Pet Shop here on Roblox. So with that being said, I guess I'm going to wrap up this video from Roblox. It's been cool to play the LPS Roblox game. We'll definitely do some more parts on it. It just launched, so... We've done what we can, and it's been a very fun, um, a very fun time. And I'm sure as we get some new pets, unbox them on video, and we redeem the codes, I'll have more pets to show you guys in the game. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Hopefully you didn't find it too laggy. But let me know in the comments if you guys are watching this and you made it this far. Are you guys, is your game crashing a bunch? Are you having some issues with lag, or is your game fine? Because I've have been having a little, but it's been fine now for me. So I want to know your guys' thoughts. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I'll see you guys next week. And Vlogmas is starting up next week. So stay tuned to my channel. Thank you guys for the continued support. And I'll see you guys next week for LPS Vlogmas 2023. Have a good one, everyone. Peace out. Enjoy the weekend.